Hello ServiceNow enthusiasts. Welcome to day 1 of our exciting journey into customer service management. I am here to guide you through the world of CSM. If you are a ServiceNow developer, admin or just a beginner, you are in the right place to boost your skills. Just a quick heads up before we get started. The demo we will be showcasing is on the Utah version of ServiceNow. Keep in mind that features and user interface may be slightly different. Without further ado, let's dive in. First, let us understand what CSM is all about. Customer Service Management is a powerful module within the ServiceNow platform designed to streamline and enhance the entire customer service experience. It's like a command center for delivering exceptional customer support. Now let's get hands on with a quick demo to see how CSM works. Now let me illustrate this using a real life example because there is nothing quite like a real world scenario to make things crystal clear. Imagine you are a ServiceNow admin at a tech support company called TechEase. TechEase provides IT support to various business. You recently implemented CSM module to enhance customer support. A key client, Innovate Tech, faces a critical IT issue that's impacting their operation. Their email server is down, causing communication chaos among their employees. Innovate Tech urgently needs a resolution. So without CSM, Innovate contacts TechEase via email, phone calls and support tickets. Communication is scattered, making it hard to understand the issue's severity. Support agents manually assign the case to an available technician, which can cause delays. Updates on the case progress are infrequent, causing frustration for Innovate Tech. But with CSM, Innovate Tech logs into TechEase customer portal powered by CSM. They submit a detailed inquiry about the email server issue. CSM also centralizes all case information, including previous interaction, knowledge article related to all email server problems. CSM also automatically assigns the case to a technician experienced in email server issues. Automated workflow provide real-time updates on Innovate Tech. They receive immediate acknowledgement and are kept informed about the resolution steps. So, in this brief example, CSM streamlines communication, automates case handling and ensures timely response, resulting in faster resolution and increased customer satisfaction. Key components of CSM The first one is case management. At its core, CSM is about managing customer cases or inquiries. These cases can range from simpler queries to complex issues. CSM helps you track, prioritize and resolve them efficiently. Knowledge Management Knowledge is power and CSM knows that. It provides a knowledge base where you can store articles, FAQs and resources. These assets empower both customer and agents to find solution quickly. Customer Portals Your customers are the heart of CSM. It offers a user-friendly portal where they can submit inquiries, view the status of the cases and access self-service resources. Automation and Workflows CSM streamlines processes. It can automate case management, prioritize case based on urgency and triggered workflows for seamless case resolution. Reporting and Analytics Want to track performance and identify area of improvement? CSM offers robust reporting and analytics tools to help you do that very efficiently. Now, let's talk about how cases can be created in CSM. There are multiple ways to create a case in CSM. First, a customer can log in to a customer portal and submit cases directly through a user-friendly portal. Second would be through email integrations. Cases can be created automatically when customer sends email to a designated support email address. Another would be agent manual entry. A agent can create cases manually when they receive inquiries, 
via phone or other channels. CSM offers multiple pathway to ensure no customer inquiry goes unnoticed. Now we will take an example and show you how a cases can be created easily. The customer will log into the customer portal. To access the customer portal in ServiceNow, all you need to do is add CSM to the end of your ServiceNow instance URL. Once you log into the customer portal, you can see different options such as support, case, my list and knowledge. Under case, click on create product case. Then you can see a form appear on your screen. Fill the required fields and submit the form. Once you submit the form, the case will be auto-generated by CSM module in ServiceNow. This inquiry is converted as case and you can see a case number getting generated. Copy this case number, go to your ServiceNow instance and in the case module, search for your case number. Finally, let's paint a simple picture of how CSM works. Imagine a circle of customer engagement. At the center is your CSM platform. Customer interact with your organization through various channels like portal, email or phone. CSM captured these interaction as cases, assigns them to the right agent and empowers agent with knowledge to resolve issues swiftly. Great job everyone. You have now grasped the fundamentals of CSM. In this day one tutorial, we covered what CSM is, why is it essential, its key applications, how cases are created and even a simple diagram to visualize the process. Stay tuned for more CSM insights in our upcoming tutorials. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more ServiceNow insights. I'll see you again in the next tutorial.